As you can see, there's a carbon ring on the hammer. That is from the firing pin. Now that happened because of how the cap was designed. It has a hole in it, so when the firing pin strike, it makes direct contact with the primary compound, making it extremely light. But the downside of the hole is, it obviously leaks gas back into the firing pin, making the firing pin rust faster, and the gas bringing particle with it increase friction on some moving part. So this area under the barrel. It's getting worn down by high pressure gas coming from the cartridge and it is not good. I obviously put a strip on it to protect it but it clearly didn't work. So I'm gonna have to put something else like a strip of metal so it doesn't worn down. So here are the bullet. Some of the writing band came off and that is very dangerous because one of them got stuck in the barrel. Like this. That could cause an extreme failure, but that didn't happen, luckily. And here's the, the casing. They're doing fine. None of them rupture, so they are reusable. Which is nice. So, about the making of the cartridge. All of them are made the same, but the difference is on some of them, uh, the bullet goes in pretty easily, only on one of them, where I have to push them pretty hard for it to go in. And that one was the best one. What I was expecting was uh, for the rifling to do its job as increase the friction because it have to bite into the rifling. But that clearly wasn't the case, that the performance was drastically different from cartridge to cartridge.